My apologies. I was wearing my mask because I just got back from a full day of being a good person. I love my mask because it's a simple yet effective way to display my righteousness. Am I concerned that two children in China dropped dead because they were forced to wear masks in gym class? Nope. Am I concerned that we're creating a generation of children who will be socially awkward and conditioned to fear their fellow man? No. Am I concerned that I'm contributing to an impending socialist technocracy that will enslave the global population? Not even a little bit. Am I concerned that my mask is symbolic of my compliance to the social conditioning that will eventually lead to the forced vaccination of every man, woman, and child on planet Earth? Not a chance. And why am I not concerned, you ask? I'm not concerned because I decided a long time ago that shallow and significant gestures are a much easier way to showcase my morality than actually being moral. Because in order to be a real good person, I gotta stand up to a real bad person. And I don't like standing up to or for anything. I've decided that it's much easier to trick my own mind into thinking compliance is a virtue instead of what compliance actually is. Cowardice. I prefer to float through life completely ignorant to the fact that every socialist takeover has always begun in the exact same way. With government overreach, public shaming, censorship, and a toilet paper shortage. Don't believe me? Google toilet paper shortage in communist Russia. Did you think you were having a unique experience? I prefer to pretend history never repeats itself so that I can stand by and turn a blind eye every time history repeats itself. I prefer to call anyone who speaks up, fights back, or stands their ground a lunatic or a conspiracy theorist so that I don't feel obligated to do my own research. Research takes away from me time. And lastly, I prefer to put on my mask and stand among a sea of masks so that I never have to be seen, be free, or reveal the deep dark shadows that lurk within me.